When millions of Americans woke up Wednesday morning to go to work, many asked themselves a simple question, is my car safe to drive? A day earlier, Dakota, the Japanese maker of airbags, agreed to double to 34 million the number of vehicles in the United States that needed to be recalled. The vehicles may contain airbags that can explode violently when they deploy, sending pieces of metal flying into the cabin. Six deaths have been linked to the problem. But automakers on Wednesday were still sorting out which cars needed to be included in the expanded recall, leaving many consumers with more questions than answers. John Young, of San Jose, A, California, is not sure whether his 2003 Honda Accord is affected. Although certain 2003 Accords have been listed under previous Dakota related recalls, when he typed his vehicle identification number into the government's website, safeaircar.gov, none of those recalls, not to mention the one announced Tuesday, were listed. This has been tough to follow, Young, 35, said. Very confusing. For now, he still drives the car every day to work, he said but he does not like having his wife in the passenger seat. To make matters more complicated, Young was recently mailed a recall notice for a different car that the couple owned, a Honda Civic, which was wrecked in a crash about three years ago. The airbags in that car, he said, deployed properly and no one was hurt. 